Hey everybody, this is Matt at Texas Toast Guitars, where safety is always the number one priority. So today, I'm in the paint booth at Texas Toast Guitars, and uh, not very many people have ever seen the inside of the paint booth. Now you are one of the people watching the inside of the paint booth. So um, I wanted to do a quick video on this contraption that uh, I had made for me by my good friend Kevin, the same guy who makes the uh, brain surgery bridges for us. And uh, this one is specifically for my, my other good buddy, Mike Learn, who is, uh, has forgotten more about painting in the last 10 seconds than I will probably ever know. But uh, Mike was interested in this rig that we came up with. Um, so basically it is an engine stand that we made uh, an armature for to hold guitars. And as you can see, um, what we've done here is we've taken and we have uh, adapted some the, this three-quarter inch EMT conduit stuff that you can buy at Lowe's or Home Depot. And here's a bent one, and we actually just go ahead and screw these. We'll get a picture, uh, a close-up picture of how this is attaches to the uh, the guitar. This is just we just made this on a stick here, and all you do is. This holds the uh, holds the guitar while you're painting, and you can see you can paint everything, and you pull the stick out, and then you hang this up, and you go to the next one. And it's particularly cool on the set necks, and again, we'll get a good picture of this. So with the set neck. Um, again, we've got this 90 degree bend in the, the conduit that's attached to the pickup. And, um, you know, it's pretty nice too to have a handle on the, uh, on the guitar. So what you do is you slide this in, and you line up the hole, because a machinist built this for us. This is a pretty, pretty high tech piece of gear. And we put this clevis pin in, and now we have the guitar is held and it's indexed properly. This might be a little bit low, but you'll see here in a second, when we rotate the guitar body, put this pin back in here, you can get to everything. You can move the stand, you can paint the back, or you can pull this pin out, rotate again, And now you have nice access to your guitar. And then once again, when you're ready to uh, take it off the armature, you just pop this clevis pin out, pull the whole unit out. You got the nice handle here, hang it up, go to the next one. So my previous attempt actually worked pretty well. And it was this rig that I made here. It's got some hinges. It's got some Lazy Susan hardware. And the same kind of deal, you just would stick the EMT conduit in there and, and it would hold it all right. It was pretty good. But this baby, uh, it might be a sorry ass engine stand. What is that? Is this in the way? <laughs> so this might be a lousy engine stand, but it is a fantastic uh, guitar holding stand. And I think I paid $46 for this engine stand at Harbor Freight. So and then we and we made this aluminum armature piece here, and I had this handle and it, it's lost. So um, anyway, thanks for watching. And if you have any questions, please feel free to let us know in the comment section. We'll be happy to answer them for you. If you like the video, make sure to subscribe. Check us out on Facebook. Uh, this is Matt Flaherty with Texas Toast Guitars, reminding you that if you're so smart, build it yourself. That's what I do.